You want to add more RAM to Minecraft? To do that, you're going to go into the Installations tab in your Minecraft launcher and then select the installation you want. This will work with modded Minecraft. For example, you could use a Forger Fabric profile, but we'll just go ahead and do it to vanilla here. And then you want to go ahead and click the More Options after selecting your profile. We're just clicking directly on the profile here. Then More Options. The first number you see here. Now for you, it might be a 2G, for example. For me, it is a was a 4G. That number is the amount of RAM dedicated to Minecraft. So for example, 2G is 2 gigabytes, 4G is 4 gigabytes, and 6 gigs is 6 gigabytes. Now, with that being said, the amount of RAM you need is really going to depend on what you're doing in Minecraft. But if this video does help you out, be sure to like and subscribe. And now, if you're not running a bunch of Minecraft mods, just vanilla Minecraft, honestly, I would recommend 2 gigabytes of RAM. 4 gigabytes, if you really want to make sure you never have any RAM issues, is going to be enough for vanilla. If you're running a few mods, like some maybe visual mods, shaders, or something like that, you might be able to get away with 4 gigs. But generally, when you have Minecraft mods, I recommend pushing your RAM up to 6 gigs pretty much right away. Especially once you pass over that 50 mod mark, that 25 to 50 mods, I would recommend going ahead, upping things to 6 gigabytes, and honestly, that will take you all the way up to around 100 mods usually, depending on the mods you have installed. For anything over 100, I would recommend going to 8 gigabytes of RAM, and most of the time, that's going to be more than enough for Minecraft. Some modern mod packs, like Ball of the Mods 10 or Better Minecraft, might need 10 or 16 gigabytes of RAM dedicated to Minecraft, but that's very rare, even with those mod packs, usually they're good running with 8 gigabytes of RAM. With that being said, never dedicate more than a half of the amount of RAM you have to Minecraft. So if we go to system information here, we will be able to see that my computer has 64 gigabytes of RAM installed physical memory. That's how much RAM my computer has, meaning I should never dedicate more than 32 gigs. But generally, you don't really ever need more than like 16 gigabytes dedicated to Minecraft. So if you had 32 gigabytes of RAM, you can max out the RAM Minecraft would really ever need. However, you could if you had 16 gigabytes of RAM, only dedicate 8 gigs to it. Now with our amount of RAM set there, we can actually see this in-game pretty easily. And while Minecraft is launching, how about a message from our hosting provider, Simple Game Hosting. At Simple Game Hosting, you can easily start a Minecraft server for you and your friends. One click install mod packs, customize it with plugins or individual mods as well. And there's even expert live chat support there to help you out along the way. So check out Simple Game Hosting at the first link in the description down below. The breakdown.xyz slash sgh and start your Minecraft server the simple way. Nonetheless, in-game, like I said, we can actually do this pretty easily. We'll just jump into a quick single player world here. And then once we're in game, all we need to do is press F3. Then in the top right, you'll be able to see the memory. The second number here is how much you have dedicated. 4,096 megabytes is four gigabytes because each gigabyte is 1,024 megabytes. Now we can also see the active amount of RAM being used. As you can see, up to about 1,800 megabytes of RAM, 1.8 gigabytes of RAM being used. So if you have any questions, let us know in the comment section down below. But you don't know everything you need to know about allocating more RAM to Minecraft. We'll see you in the next video, and I'm out. Peace.